Be successful. I was gonna ask you how this worked, but it looks like it's never it's been used. It's never been used, so I can't tell you how it works. It's supposed to cool you off. All right, well, I'm gonna take a shot with it. We will, we will see. All right. $3. Oh, those are just containers. Oh, God. Empty. <laughs> Empty containers? Empty containers. Nothing else, huh? Nothing else, I don't, I don't think so. All right. Oh, that's a torn dollar. Give you a better I don't one than that. Think we want that. <laughs> no, we don't want that one. There All you right, go. All right, thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. There. Yep. Okay. See ya. Be successful. Morning. Morning. I love your shirt. Thank you. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Interesting. And, uh, actually it was my okay. How much do you have on it? Oh, two dollars. Two bucks. How much is your VCR? Would you take the TV to? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I... no, two dollars. Yeah. Two dollars for both. Two dollars. Two dollars. Okay. I I don't think I definitely don't need the TV. But I will take the VCR. I will so take I it. Tell you what. Three dollars for the photo. Three bucks? Man, that's it. Great deal. Yeah, oh no, thanks. Just keep it. Thank Just go. Right. Just go. You can let me know about the other two. Maybe should make you a deal. Get all three. How much are those? Five of these. Oh, I like your mock man shirt. Oh, thank you. Did you go there? All of that. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh, you know what? That's going to be back there. Yeah. Oh, you can walk through? Yeah. Yeah. But we got to go in the store. That's pretty neat. Yeah. 
I want to go to the, they've canceled the festival the past two years. 28, do you do 20, 25 for everything? That sounds fine. Right. Awesome. Yeah. There's 30. And I'll take this for you. Sure. Yep. All right, guys. Uh, we are back, back to the shop. Uh, another, another good day. It was a really good weekend of picking. Uh, we had a lot of fun this weekend. Um, so actually, the first thing I'm going to start with, real quick here. Actually, I went back to the church sale. Uh, they closed at two. I got there maybe around one o'clock or so. I went back to the DVDs. I figured I left some Acorn Media. I didn't feel like I left this much, uh, but I did. So I left about 58 more dvds so i bought all of these uh for uh, a buck a piece basically i gave him i gave him 60 bucks for all of it um so we've got some some midsummer murders series one three discs so uh, it's not the complete set i don't believe but still these should do very well uh, i've got some inspector morse uh, and then these some of these i'm not familiar with at all george gently i am not familiar with Blue Murder, uh, Endeavor. A lot of these I'm not familiar with, but uh, basically anytime I'm seeing Acorn Media, if it's a dollar, I'm gonna go ahead and pick it up. I think at worst I can lot them up and uh, you know make make that work. Uh, I also picked up this this Timberland uh, travel backpack for three. It's actually pretty nice. Uh, I haven't seen this exact model, but I think I can get about forty dollars. Uh, out of this bag. It's it's a pretty nice, pretty nice old bag. What else we got here? Uh, so I picked up this this Tomcat. Uh, this is it's a new bright. I don't know if it's really worth anything, but basically she she charged me three dollars for this and the Samsung DVD VCR player. So I figured out at worst if it's worth nothing, the kids will take it. They'll they'll have fun playing with it. I just thought it looked really interesting having this kind of remote control attached to it. Uh, but again, I'm not familiar with this one at all. So, so we'll have to see. Okay, here I picked up, um, this is a, a tape deck. They said it wasn't used, but I don't I don't know if I'd buy that. Um, but this is a pretty old little car tape deck. It was five bucks. I don't think it has the connectors in here though. And it come with all these speakers. So I'm just gonna throw this out there, I'm sure someone will be interested in picking up but I, I really don't know the I don't know the value or worth on that one uh, I bought this Panasonic uh, DVD video CD CD player I gave them five for it uh, with the remote I think this is close to a 50 50 to uh, I'm gonna say 40 to 70 is what I've seen comps uh, on it uh, at this point. Um, so it looks like it's in pretty good shape, obviously, having the remote and everything. So we'll make sure it powers on and we can get some sound out of it. Well, that was five. Uh, this is one of those things that just, you, you overlook these all the time. Uh, this is a Disney Teach and Lights phone. Uh, this was a dollar. Uh, this sells 18 to 20 bucks. Um, again, you know, I, I'm, I'm wanting higher average sale price. I'm wanting 30 to $50. But for something this small for, for a dollar, it's too too hard to pass that up. Also picked up some more cameras. Like I said, anytime I see the point and shoots, I'm just I'm picking them up if they're cheap enough. Uh, this is a Sanyo VPC E760. I don't know. I haven't looked that one up yet. What else we have in here? Uh, Jessica picked this up. This is a Wearing Pro uh belgian waffle maker these things are actually really nice this one looks super clean as well so we paid 10 for that um i haven't looked it up but i think i think jessica was seeing it right around 70 or so but you know I'll, I'll look it up i'll throw the comps up there once i get to it i got a couple other things here i don't know anything about this this is a blow blow blocks blow i don't know something uh, wearable fan. It was three bucks. It was new in the package. So I just grabbed it. Uh, another point and shoot. This is a Canon PowerShot A720. Uh, they paid two hundred dollars for this in two thousand and seven, and I bought it for four. It's not selling for two hundred right now. I know that. 
uh, but it should be right around thirty to forty dollars. I thought this guy was just funny. This is the Mr. Peanut vintage Mr. Peanut hat for a buck. Um, yeah, I don't I don't know if it's worth anything. It's probably not, but I grabbed it anyway. I don't know if I can show these on YouTube or not. Um, I never bought these before. Uh, but so he had a lot of uh, Playboys from 1968. Uh, paid 22 bucks for for all of them. I think there's 13. I think the whole year is here plus plus uh, plus one. So I have to do some research on these. I don't think these are anything crazy. It, it might it might bring 50. 50 to 60 bucks maybe so we'll we'll take a look at the condition and whatnot on those uh this i know absolutely nothing about i don't know if it's it, it's probably not worth anything but it was only two dollars and it looked very interesting so it's the the midnight rides of paul revere uh the roger wheeler i don't know inscription on tablet where revere was captured i just thought this looked really cool um so if it's not worth anything, if I don't can't find any comps on it, I'm I'm sure some history person will will appreciate this one, especially for two bucks. Uh, back there we've got three sets of American Girl books. Uh, Jessica found those. Uh, Samantha, Julian, Kit. Uh, I think I want to say the Samantha one. I think that set sells for about thirty-five to forty. And then I think the Julie and Kit go for about 20 to 25. They're in great condition, uh, so that should have no problem selling. And the last thing, uh, the mystifying Ouija board. Um, I'm not sure the year on this one yet. I still need to figure that out. The box is in terrible, terrible condition. Uh, it does have the planchet with it, and it was only two bucks, so I need to look it up figure out exactly which one it is to see to see what that one's worth but but like i said overall it was a really good day uh it's been a really good weekend we got a ton of ton of stuff which is great we're getting the the season starting it's going to start to wind down so these next couple of weeks is really trying to build up that inventory for the fourth quarter so it was a lot of fun thank you guys for hanging along it's a lot of fun thank you guys for hanging out it's been a long video i'm sure so uh if you've made it this far Thank you very, very much. And until next time, stay curious.